Michelle Doherty, one of the directors of the Emmy-nominated documentary Sonic Sea. I'm Eitor Pereira, the composer. Sonic Sea is a documentary about a world that's rarely ever seen. It's a film about the damage that industrial and military noise is putting into the ocean that's affecting marine life that are dependent on sound to survive. But hopefully it's also a film about the opportunities that we have to fix these problems. I think the challenge in making the music for Sonic Sea was exactly not to get on the way of the constant symphony that happens under the ocean. So in a way, if the way is singing a melody, I should be just acting as a counterpoint to that melody. What Hatred did was so beautiful because there was moments that are very simple in their composition so that it lets the picture breathe so that the mm -hmm. audience can move through the film and make their own decisions. We used the music to emphasize the life and the death, really. Creating harmony and dissonance was a huge part of this film. Visually, we did it by showing the sereneness of this ocean and then injecting man-made sound into that. We saw this globe with all these shipping lanes. You helped us feel what it felt like underwater. I did create a drum kit of the shipyard metals. We just kept researching which sounds are completely antagonistic to the sounds of the ocean. You know, and quite frankly, all of them. In order for those sounds to travel and communicate a message, there can be like this veil and this curtain of these horrible sounds. Whales depend on sound as their sight. Without an environment where they can hear each other, they can perish. To me, it was really important to be part of this. This now is part of my life, and I hope it's part of yours, because it takes a documentary like this to bring awareness, and now you can do something about it.